vaccinated since very young, since they were in elementary school, that white are the evil people. Fear the evil white boogeyman. Right? And then the, the, white, the white man has his boot on the neck of every minority out there. And that they somehow have to right the wrongs of their ancestors. This is nonsense, people. This is bullshit. What they're trying to do is if they... If they, they're trying to destroy Western civilization. So once again, we are going to demoralize them. And I get a hoot out of that. We are going to humiliate them. We are going to destroy them. All you cocksuckers in fucking Boston, watch out. We're coming for you. Joining us in studio, Joe Biggs, InfoWars auxiliary reporter, freelance reporter, does his own great work. Joe, it's great to have you here with us. Oh, yeah, it's been a while. Looking sharp at the blur. But then you learn the school had been closed and reopened, and you got video of the kids going in circles in and out of the building, and they don't call the rescue choppers for two hours, and then they tear the building down and seal it, and they, they get caught using blue screens, and uh, an a email by Bloomberg comes out in the lawsuit where he's telling his people, get ready in the next 24 hours to capitalize on a shooting. Uh, yeah, so Sandy Hook is a synthetic, completely fake, with actors, in my view, manufactured. I couldn't believe it at first. I knew they had actors there, clearly, but I thought they killed some real kids. And it just shows how bold they are that they clearly used actors. I mean, they even ended up using photos of kids killed in mass shootings here in a fake mass shooting in Turkey. So, yeah, uh, or, or, or Pakistan. The sky is now the limit. 20 children, six adults, were murdered in that horrific massacre. OERS spoke on the phone with Larry Posner. His son Noah was just six years old when he was murdered. Lenny, thank you for joining us. You doing okay? How are you? I'm good. Thank you. How how's uh, your how's mom and and, and all the uh, the rest of the children? Um, everyone is doing well. We are uh, moving along quite well. Yeah. So tonight we're we're talking on the phone. We're not doing it in person because uh, you don't like to reveal your location or appear on camera because of the amount of threats that you've received, in large part from people who incredibly have been led to believe that Sandy Hook, that the shooting, was a hoax. I mean, this must be unfathomable to you and your family, and I'm so sorry. So can you please tell our audience about that if you can? Well, I know for uh, for people it's hard to uh, imagine that uh, the people think this way, that they have this type of worldview. Uh, I'm quite accustomed to it after years of being uh, exposed to it and um, having to read comments that people post on my social media pages, um, making accusations and insulting uh, me, the memory of my murdered son. So this is what I have to deal with. So, so let's talk about Alex Jones. 